With this topic, you actually get to use a calculator to solve, and we're just trying to take our fraction and write it as a percent. So when you're given a fraction, um, that line that is between the two numbers means divide. So you're going to do um, 2 divided by 51, and because you want it in a percent, you times it by 100. And probably the hardest thing to do then is to round. We're supposed to round to the nearest tenth. So tenth is the first place past the decimal. So if the number here is five or more, you're going to add one to the tenth place. If it's um, four or less, you leave it the same. So that's probably uh, the hardest part is the rounding part. So let's um so let's see you want to here let's write this down you're going to take the numerator divide by the denominator 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 and then we're going to times by 100 and we get to use a calculator so it shouldn't be too bad so we're going to take uh for this problem we're going to take 24 divide it by 35 and then times 100. And then what we have to do is round it to the nearest 10. So we'll do 24 divided by 35 times, uh-oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, we have to move over. How do you move over? You can just click on it, times 100. Okay, so we're given um, 68.57 and we're rounding the um to the nearest tenth since this is above five so this is greater than five we're going to add one to the tenth place so we're going to actually write type in 68.6 it's nice that they already wrote down the percent sign for us um, I don't want to clear all the drawings. I just want to erase this one and this one. Okay, let's go to the next problem. Okay, the fraction is 5 67 So with our calculator, we're going to do 5 divided by 67 times that fraction times 100. And then we'll round. So we'll do 5 divided by 67. We have to move over when we times by 100. And we get 7.46. And we're looking to round the 4. So the 6, since it's greater than 5, we're going to add 1 to the 4. So we'll, we'll type in 7.5. Okay, that's the end of the lesson.